In this video, I am going to show you a program that I have rewritten called Accento. I'm giving it away for free, so if you want it, the relevant details can be found in the description underneath the video. It is a special form of text editor for writing in Spanish, French, Italian and German. As you can guess, by pressing these buttons I get all sorts of symbols and letters. There are general symbols as well and these three will put the cursor in between this extra little feature there. I have an IPA section for the International Phonetic Alphabet if you want to use that. I'm still working on that so that might be a little bit different by the time you download it. So that's one way of typing things in. Now if you want to use slashes and colons I suggest that you don't use keyboard shortcuts if you're typing in a web address for example. But when it is enabled it will place accents above certain letters which is in the instructions there. If I just resize that. So, for example, if I want to type in Cormoister, I can type in the question mark twice. It'll invert it, cut, or I hit the slash key, Cormoista, put the slash there. Let's say if I press C and type in 5, puts a cedilla there. So it's all of these type of things. I can have an umlaut, a U, and I hit the colon. E, I hit shift and 6 on my keyboard, which is a UK keyboard. So I can spell être. So être. Être. There are other features. This is only available in Spanish, this particular button, but I'm going to have it in other languages. It just takes quite a bit of programming that does, so I can type in the number 1999 for example, and it'll convert it into words. In the French section, there are certain things I don't like typing, like qu'est-ce que c'est, so I've just got a few phrases there, like qu'est-ce que, and then can type in c'est, qu'est-ce que c'est. If I hover the mouse over that, you can see which symbols that this particular button prepends a space. So I hit that and it'll put a space before the question mark and it's copied everything to the clipboard. If I press paste, I get guess que c'est. So those are the main features I'm going to add to this. That's a copy everything button, I'll cut, copy, paste, you can load and save plain text. I normally use this for writing certain things on the internet, so you could use it for writing, I don't know, status messages on Facebook or something like that. It's written in Java, so the actual program itself will be called accento.jar or something like that but you need the Java runtime environment on your system first. That's explained in the descriptions underneath the video. So it's not an actual executable file in the traditional sense. So I think that's everything. So by the time you download it, I'll have probably added a few things to it, but I think I shall leave it there. So thank you for listening. Goodbye.